Willie Anderson begins the planting of the seed potatoes, using a bag apron slung in front of him like a satchel. In earlier times, the bottom of the drills would have been filled with cow manure, but by the 1940s and 50s, the manure would have been ploughed into the ground during the winter, so by this time you had at least a clean footing if the weather was dry. You had to put down every one down up to the, up to the year, from the bottom of the ground, different we, we used to just stand up straight, you know, home and throw them, drop them down. You had to, you had to put the man down on, on he would he would be spread the way he would come, he'd come across a lot of time and had a room and it much of the it it much of the cut. Oh they were far far too particular, you know, at that at that time. The seed box was also beginning to appear about this time. This system ensured that the back was bent at all times. The seed were pushed into the drill, each in turn nudged with the heel of one boot against the toe cap of the other. As Jim explained, not all farmers were easy to work for. Some would stride among the drills inspecting, measuring and looking for faults and usually finding them easily enough. Although this ground had been given a dressing of cow manure last winter, Alex Butler now applies artificial fertiliser. 